Hey guys and welcome back to another vlog. This one's gonna be a really exciting one because Alex and I are in Portugal right now. We rented a VW bus and we're gonna drive around the country. I've been wanting to go to Portugal for ages so I'm super happy that we finally made it happen and I'm very very excited to have this bus because we're able to explore Portugal so freely and we can just drive wherever we want to go and we can sleep in the bus so yeah I'm super excited so we just woke up um, what time did we wake up at 7 right? Yeah. woke up at 7 because we're gonna try and catch the sunrise and I said I don't know if we're gonna be late but it's looking really really pretty outside already and we're gonna go to the spot it's called Punta Piedade it's a little bit touristy but it's like this iconic spot where they have all these really cool rocks in the water and we went yesterday already but yesterday there was so we went at like 10 or 11 but there were so many tourists so we decided to go early today how do you feel about getting up early Alex because usually you hate it right we made it in time for sunrise it was really really beautiful um, barely any people here and right now Alex is behind me he's flying the drone and yeah the view is incredible guys I'm going to show you right now So after our little morning mission, Alex and I are about to get some breakfast. It's actually already like 12 o'clock and I'm super hungry and I think Alex is too. We're both a little bit hangry. We're in Lagos, which is like the cutest little town. And I was so surprised because they have so many vegan options. And right now we're going to a place I found on Instagram. It's called Coffee and Waves and they have acai bowls, which is all I really want. And I'm really excited to eat. brunch session which was really nice by the way um, we were contemplating of whether we should go further along the Algarve so towards Faro or kind of back towards Lisbon and I put it on my story I was like oh what do you guys think because I always get such good tips on Instagram and then actually um, someone wrote to me that there is kind of like a hurricane approaching Lisbon which um, sounds pretty scary I don't think it's that bad and says Portugal is facing the region's strongest Atlantic storm since 1842 Sounds a bit scary, so we're not gonna go back to Lisbon yet. So usually I always decide where we go, but today I made the big mistake of letting all the people know we're gonna drive to. And now we're at like some. At the best beach in Portugal. No, we had to go down this like really weird dirt road, and there's like no other cars, and. Are you leading us too? They found the cutest dogs. They're so cute. Oh, check this out. So Look, Alex, you have a new friend. <laughs> Is this the beach, Alex? It looks like England. place called Sesimbra right now it's just below Lisbon and um, I found this really cute cafe because I typed in vegan spots in Google Maps and it's called Aloha cafe and we're about to get like a late lunch and we just discovered that there's some really cool waves here which are not too big and Alex really wants to go and um, check them out but I'll show you the cafe now so this is a cafe you can sit outside here and you can have a look at the ocean and I don't know if you can see, but there's some, some nice waves. So I got an apple, carrot, ginger juice, and a smoothie bowl. And this one has chocolate, peanut butter, cacao. Well, cacao is chocolate. Cacao, banana, and peanut butter. So as a smoothie bowl expert, I'm gonna give you my expert opinion on this. First of all, we have a very nice consistency, which is probably due to the peanut butter. Mm. It's very good. Love cacao. Mm -hmm. Very nice, so give it 
7.5 out of 10. I hate it when the person you eat with orders something that you also want to eat. Do you hate it too, Alex? Yum, 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 yum. Oh, it's a sweet potato. It's raining. So Alex and I spent the night in Irizaira, which is like a surfer town in the north of Lisbon. And we were hoping that today maybe we could try and surf. But uh, when we woke up, it was raining, so um, it didn't look that good. So we decided to make the most out of this weather. And now we just drove to Lisbon because we actually haven't spent any time here yet. So we're about to get breakfast. I got an acai bowl as per usual. Now it's got oats, and these oats look so good. What is it? Almond butter? Cacao okay, nibs, granola. Mm, yummy. Admittedly, the weather today is very strange because as you saw, it just rained like a few minutes ago, but now it's stopped raining and it's sunny again. Um, but we just walked up some stairs and we're at this like, viewpoint thing, kind of vibe where you can see the city, which is pretty cool. So I was sitting on this patch because it looked really cool for a picture, but now my bum is really wet because I don't know if you can see it. It's like, <laughs> it's like I peed my pants. Is it bad? Yeah. So today is our last day here in Portugal. We didn't spend a night in Lisbon. We went to Erizaira again and we're about to get breakfast or um, we pretty much just went to a breakfast spot when I checked my Instagram DMs. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. <laughs> anyway. Someone or a couple of you guys were like, Oh, you're in Erizaira. Erizaira. I cannot say this place, but some of you are like, They have a Nalu bowls. And if you like watch my Bali vlogs or if you know about like Bali, like Nalu bowls is like the most insane like smoothie bowl place, and I'm obsessed with it. And they have one here. So, like, the waitress was about to get out, take our order, and I was like, I told Alex, I was like, I'm not gonna have anything because they have Nalu bowls, so we have to go there now. I just went back to the bus to um, grab the vlog camera. Okay, I'm gonna navigate us to Nalu bowls now. And I already said I'm so sad about having so much food in my vlogs because I always tell myself like I won't do it. I'm always like, no, no, it's not so much food. But then it's like what I get the most excited about. So I kind of feel like I have to put it in. You know what I mean? Okay, Alex, I'll tell you which one you have to get. Oh, there's a, the JB one is the best because it's worth peanut butter. So this is gonna be the moment of truth where, because we're about to bring back the car. We've um, just filled up the tag and now we're just kind of cleaning it from the outside. And the reason why this is gonna be very interesting is because, well, I haven't mentioned yet why we rented the car and I didn't want to recommend anything until we've like finished everything. Like you'll know if the car rental is good um, if you bring it back and they don't charge you for like random stuff. So we're hoping that, you know, we can just bring it back smoothly. They're not gonna, I don't know, find any scratches that weren't there because we didn't damage the car at all. So I'm quite curious to see if everything goes smoothly. Carly's just cleaning the car from the outside because he said if it's clean outside then they're gonna be less likely to like look for random scratches. I'm just a bit worried because they said we have to bring it back like at six o'clock exactly and it's already quarter to six and it's fucking we're gonna be late. No, it takes 18 minutes to get there. So we'll be late for sure. Let's hope that's not a problem. Alex, do you think they'll charge us for something we haven't Thousands. done? <laughs> I'm curious to see. Everything is fine, guys. We just returned the car and we didn't have to pay anything extra. And now I can finally share with you what rental company we used. We used Indie Campers uh, because they were one of the cheapest 
and they turned out to be really really good we're super happy with the car and the staff was super friendly and helpful i am at the airport right now which is why there might be people running behind me but we just gotta drop up our luggage we're actually here like way too early um but yeah gotta drop up our luggage and then we're gonna fly back to barcelona tonight i'm gonna end this vlog here because it's actually quite late i'm super tired but thanks so much for watching and i'll see you in the next video bye, -bye.